Advice on how to stretch your gas dollars are popping up on Facebook. One post says, try this, filling up in the morning while slowly squeezing the nozzle. But our Melissa Correa found out none of this will actually make a visible difference in your gas mileage. Ramanan Krishnamurti knows fuel. I'm the chief energy officer at the University of Houston. Teaches petroleum engineering when he's not fact-checking Facebook posts. You know, the, the reality is there are very few things that you can do you can save your pain at the pump, right? Strategy at the pump is not one of them, like only filling up in the morning when ground temperatures are cooler, making gasoline more dense. Filling up your tank in the morning nonsense. Your storage tank is in the ground and the ground temperature doesn't change a whole lot. Changes with, with seasons, but day and night, it doesn't change a whole lot. That's a myth. Just like the pressure you place on the nozzle. Filling it up slowly, fast, doesn't make a whole lot of difference. The Petro expert says modern gas pumps are designed to prevent vaporization, while the post suggests you fill up when at a half tank. So, absolutely. Uh, false on that one. The professor says that alone will not improve mileage. You want to reduce the weight in your car. It'll give you better gas mileage. So if you've got a trunk full of junk, take it out. You'll see your miles per gallon go up. The fact that people are trying to share these tips and tricks that really aren't going to take you far. I think it's just a sign of how much of a struggle so many people are in. These are desperate times. You don't want to be hurt at the gas pump each time you go to fill up. For two years, we've not been able to do anything because of the pandemic. And now that we can, it hurts. The smarter thing to do is fill up your tires, make sure the pressure is right, drive conservatively. Safe driving habits that can also stretch how far your tank takes you. Melissa Correa, KHOU 11 News.